Hi guys, my name is Caitlin. Welcome to DIY University. I'm really excited to share today's project with you because it's near and dear to my heart, succulents. Uh, so today I'm going to show you guys how to make succulent planters and I'm also going to give you some tips and tricks uh, for succulent maintenance and to make it really easy for you guys to do this project. So let's get started. So first things first, you need to select a container for your succulents. I've got this terracotta pot here and I filled it with cactus soil. It's really important that you use the right soil for succulents. They don't like a lot of water, so you want a really well-draining soil. Also on the bottom of the pot, I know sometimes with certain plants you want to retain water, so people will put like a little stone or something over the hole at the bottom. Don't do that. You want the, the soil to be able to drain well. That's really important. For some succulent inspiration, I headed to Cedros Avenue Design District in Solana Beach, and here there is no shortage of awesome, really cool succulents to take a look at. Okay, I got some awesome succulents. Okay, now comes the fun part. We're gonna arrange the succulents in their pots in here in a way that we think looks attractive. And then when we feel good about how that looks, we'll actually unpot them. One of the reasons why I love succulents so much is that they're so forgiving. Most often people kill them by overwatering rather than underwatering. You should only water your plant once a week and make sure that when you're watering the soil is totally dry before you water again. In the winter, you'll water even less than that. So now that we feel good about this, we're gonna unpot the plants. Now one of the things that's unique about succulents is that you really want to make sure you expose the roots before you plant. So you can see that I'm brushing off all the dirt here, I'm taking off any dead leaves below, kind of doing some general maintenance uh, before I plant any of the plants. A little tip when you're arranging your succulent planter is to take your focal point plant, in this case it's the ruffled echeveria in the center here, and face it towards the front of the planter. Uh, rather than just facing it straight up in the planter, in which case you wouldn't be able to see the face as well. Another little tip is to create mounds out of the excess dirt. Uh, these succulent planters have a tendency to sink, especially after you water them, and you want the plants to be above the rim of the planter. So creating little mounds of dirt and then digging holes into them will help keep your succulents above the rim of the planter and make them look nicer. Thanks so much guys for tuning in. I hope you learned something about succulents today and you feel ready to try your own succulent planner. I promise you it's a ton of fun. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, you can post below uh, in the comment section. Thanks guys, bye.